finally cracked the P.F. Chang's lettuce wraps code. With that sweet and tangy Asian sauce, tender ground chicken filling, and crunchy water chestnuts. And believe it or not, you can actually make this restaurant favorite at home with easy to find ingredients and in less than 15 minutes. Oh yeah, and I'm Lana Brazil, and you are watching Evolving Table, where we make healthier spins on classic recipes. And while this recipe is already pretty dang healthy, I'm gonna show you a few simple substitutions so you can make it fit whatever dietary preferences you have. So let's jump straight in and get to cooking. You'll wanna first finely mince one cup of sweet or white onion. Try to make these pieces really small so they can blend in with the ground chicken mixture. Add one tablespoon of oil to a large skillet, along with the minced onion. Saute for two to three minutes, or until the onion becomes tender. Stir in two cloves of finely minced garlic. A garlic press makes this so quick and easy to do, or you can always mince it up by hand. And two teaspoons of minced ginger. Buying the jar of minced ginger is a huge time saver too. Continue sauteing for an additional minute or until the garlic and ginger become fragrant. Push the onion to the side of the skillet and add in one pound of ground chicken. You can also use ground beef or pork if you'd prefer. Cook for seven to eight minutes or until it is cooked through and no longer pink. One of the best things about the lettuce wraps at P.F. Chang's is how fine and tender that filling mixture is. Well, you can just go at it with your spatula and try and break apart the big clumps. But a little secret I like to do is to use a potato masher. So for those of y'all that have already been here, you know where I'm going with this. Simply mash the chicken and break apart the big clumps into fine crumbles. Yep, there we go. Wasn't that so easy? Now that we've got the chicken cooked, it's time to move on to that delicious Asian sauce. If you've made any Asian style recipes at home, chances are you probably have most of these ingredients already on hand. The one exception being hoisin sauce. This sweet sauce is a must in this recipe, so guys, don't be tempted to leave this out. Even if you're gluten-free, don't worry, I got you covered. There is an incredible gluten-free brand that I love to use. You can find it in most grocery stores or even online. I'll be sure to leave a link to this one for you. Soy sauce, rice vinegar, sesame oil, and sriracha are all pretty easy to find ingredients. If you haven't purchased these yet, you'll end up using these quite often once you start cooking more Asian food. So grab a medium-sized bowl and add 1 4th cup of hoisin sauce, 2 tablespoons of soy sauce or tamari sauce if you're gluten-free, one tablespoon of rice vinegar, one to two teaspoons of sriracha sauce. This will largely depend on how spicy you want your dish. One teaspoon of toasted sesame oil, one fourth teaspoon of black pepper, and one fourth teaspoon of salt to taste. Whisk the ingredients together until smooth and well combined. Pour the sauce into the skillet along with an eight ounce can of diced water chestnuts and be sure that you drain these before you add them in. If you can't find the diced kind, you can always buy the whole ones and then cut them into small cubes. Stir until everything is well mixed and cook over medium low heat for three to four minutes or until the chicken begins to absorb the sauce. Mmm, oh my goodness, this filling smells incredible, guys. If you're ready to eat this right now, you'll wanna go ahead and get a few leaves of lettuce ready for serving. Bib and butterleaf lettuce are the preferred type since they have large leaves and delicious flavor. Romaine or even iceberg lettuce can be used, but they won't taste quite as good. Serve the chicken mixture in a leaf and then sprinkle on some chopped green onions. If you're meal prepping these for the week, be sure to store your chicken filling and lettuce separately so as not to wilt the leaves with the sauce. Mm. Oh my goodness, those crunchy water chestnuts mixed in with that tender Asian style chicken ready in less than 15 minutes. I 
can't wait to hear what you think, so be sure to let me know. And if you want a few more healthy makeovers, make sure you check out these other restaurant copycat recipes. Thanks so much for hanging out. I'll see you in the next one.